this is the entrance. When I think of Germany, I think about Oktoberfest and Christmas markets. And finally, I am fulfilling my dreams of being at a German Christmas market. <laughs> We didn't walk out with anything. We should buy something. We didn't even have a Christmas tree. <laughs> Maybe we should start with that. Sonny is going to try to order us some hot uh, chocolate and some red wine. No, not red wine. Uh, Glue wine. Glue wine. And she's going to try to do it in German. So let's see that how that goes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That was really good actually. You didn't sound like an idiot. I did, that's fine. So the cops cold. are adorable. So you have to pay like a deposit for the cups. Yeah, does that mean we can take them? Yeah. Because we literally already paid for them. I have the glue wine. I have the hot chocolate with the, the cherry. Oh my Whoa. god. That's a lot of wine. Really good. Can you try this? Ooh, Ooh. I like this. So this is basically just very, very hot red wine. Cheap red wine. We just gave our cups back and now we have four euros. And we need four euros to buy some candy. So this was actually perfect. So now let's get some candy, guys. Apfel. Yeah. We can buy the banana. We can buy this. We cannot buy the strawberries, which is the one we want, because we only have four euros. Unless we can like... Negotiate. Yeah, should we try to negotiate? Do you want to try to negotiate? We only have four euros. <laughs> is it possible? Which one? Oh, which one, Chris? Uh, Maybe that one, with the sprinkles on. Yes, yeah. please. Thank you so Thank much. You. You're so kind. Thank you. Right. <laughs> yeah. Really cold inside. We just tried the Christmas market at the Rathausplatz in Kiel, and now we're going to try the two other ones that they're known for. The one we're just for at is known for being romantic, and the other ones just known for being something else. We don't know yet. So we're going to figure it out. Come on. It's a bit smaller, I say. Actually, much smaller. But they are famous for this one. Yeah, they're famous for the big thing, wind, wind wheel. I like the other one way better. This is nice, but the other one is so much more cozy and like more well done. It's because you got rejected by well. old lady. Like, she said Geschmacksproven, which I was like, oh, that means like, do you want to taste? And I was like, ah, oh, I want to taste. And then she just ate everything herself. And I was like, nice. <laughs> Do you know what moonshine is? No. It's like old style liquor. Oh. Yeah. Okay. oh. Yeah. Good. That's actually really nice. We're now entering the last Christmas market on our list. Let's go. I love the entrance here, by the way. It's so cute. It smells more authentic here. Maybe more like um, the trees, the Christmas tree smell. Yeah. Apparently here, cash is king, which we didn't know. We didn't bring any cash. We're gonna try to take out some money because we really want to buy a bratwurst, which is like a German hot dog. <laughs> Now we're gonna get a bratwurst. Bratwurst, yeah. Can you please have one of them? One indeed? One... Yes, please. And then one. Don't one this. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's try them. Try the bratwurst first. It's a hot dog. Let's switch. I just think the bun 
The bun is just so amazing because it's just baguette bun. <laughs> that is so warm. Yeah, it's called a hot hot dog. I like this most. It has a much more flavor to it than a normal hot dog. I feel like it's more spiced up. Overall, I love the German Christmas markets. They are wonderful, so well done, cozy, great food, great vibes. I definitely recommend.